one and a half months into the usual long rain season and the rains are nowhere to be seen. Instead, prolonged dry spell characterized by hot temperatures. The situation cutting across most parts of the country and there seemed to be no reprieve in the near future as the weatherman forecast prolonged hot and dry conditions in most parts of the country in the next one week. At this point in time, farmers are usually weeding their farms with, for example, maize plant reaching the above knee height. And with reports that the long rains might eventually totally fail, Kenyans remain a worried lot. Kulima wengis kufika wakatu bado achapanda. Na wale wamepanda ni wachache na maindi yao haina afya sana. Kwa hivyo kama wakulima wakau tuko na tashwishi sana kwa mba akutapatikana na masawa ya kutosha. Tuka mboga, bei mepanda, nyanya kuna kama tunanunua tunanunua tu kwa begali kama moja ina cost 15 shillings na unajua sasa hii pesa pia imepotea Kenya's coastal are bearing the brunt of soaring temperatures owing to the prevailing conditions Joto imekuwa mwingi hakuna mvua serikali wanatangaza kuna kutakuwa na mvua hivi karibuni lakini hatuoni mvua ni kama haitanyesha So we need immediate remedy to this because Kenyans are suffering uh, Serikali inge tungenini mambo ya miti ipandwe. Juu angalau angalau ikiwa angalau ile miti inaweza kutoa ile mama mkuu wakati mwingine kuwa na ile manyunyu manyunyu manyu kidogo. Wakulima wenyewe wameteseka kwa sababu kama hii ndio hali tunafikiri mtu atalima pipi shambani. Hawezi kulima na kitoka pale tena kuna njaa kwa sababu ya ile njoto. Na labda hakuna chakula ya kutosha. Kuna ukame. The delayed long rains, according to the weatherman, is attributed to the tropical cyclone Idai that ripped through Mozambique and Zimbabwe. Met argues that the phenomena redirected moisture away from the region. The weatherman now warns of further deterioration of food security and water resource in the country. Beatrice Gatonyengetich, Channel 1 News.